Hello YouTube, hello TikTok. Please leave us a thumbs up. Please leave a comment, I'd love to reply to you. All right, liquid white going over. And then, we're gonna throw some color about. Play some phthalo blue. We're gonna put this on straight away. And starting at the top. Oh, well, I don't want this too dark. So I'm just gonna put this on gently darker at the top. And then we'll just work our way down. Tell you what, let's go right sort of down here. Just put some colour down here. I'm gonna change the colour of that soon. This will be some water. A little touch of bright red. Just gonna put a little spot of that on. A little spot of this red around here. This is very, very powerful. Maybe a little sort of reflection down here. If we're gonna have water down here, there'll be a slight reflection so make sure you come follow me on youtube if you're not and if you're not following me on tiktok and you're watching on youtube make sure you check out the link in the description and come and follow me on tiktok this is where i do the live painting a little bit of sap green going into that blue let's go somewhere like this that's mixing with that white on there see there we go some sort of green and blue and stuff in that water. We're gonna come back and change that in a bit. And brush. So just going into some titanium white. Like this. Some circle ones there, look at that. Nice cloud coming across there. Just a big cloud there. And we're just gonna very gently just circle them bottom bits there, just blend them out. And these top bits just lift up. Whoosh. Lift up. And there we have a pretty decent cloud there. Here we go. Just some dark color. Mainly black, it's got the blue in there and that. All right, just need a little roll of paint there. I could do some nice mountains, okay? Let's do one that lives here. So I'm just using this to sort of plan out the top of the mountain. It's really scrubby in there. There's not much paint going on, really. Pull this color out. down might change the shape of this one yet for what I'm thinking but we're gonna come down like this there we go and that's mixing with that liquid white underneath there look you're gonna see how much this changes a tiny bit of black to this and just make it sort of streaky some bits here and there. Okay, we're gonna do these mountains now, okay? You'll start to see this come alive. We could have that one sort of going round a little bit here. Just pull this snow gently down. I could have them sort of going into one. There. This is quite thick paint I'm putting on actually here. Have some real, just have them going in there like that. We'll do a little bit over here. Okay. Just creating, you can do anything with mountains, look at that. I mean that's, and maybe there's just a little bit of something see there okay white and a little touch of the blue it's very powerful and the mountains sort of pop a little bit better so again a little roll of paint small end of the knife here and just bring this in leaving some of that dark and you can just sort of blend them in together because that's all shadowy in there 
want to see that blue color. Just following some of these little lumps down there. Just there, we're gonna have a little waterfall. There we go. It's very, very satisfying to do mountains, I think. Keeping that dark, not too light in there. And then we're gonna go over this side and just fill this in. And there we have a nice mountain, I think. Do some misting. All right, just gonna sweep this up here, blend these together a little bit. Just green and that sort of black color that I had there. Perhaps some land now, some trees and whatever, and then we can put some highlights on. I've just decided that I've made that greeny black and I've just gone over here into the white, okay? Took that green over there and made a very sort of paler color. And we're just gonna do some little trees in the background here. So it just goes something like this. Not worried what's going on underneath. Oh, just tapping some of that, blending that in. That's just a little row of trees behind some ones that we're going to have in, in front of it. We're just going to do some little thing. Let's do a little sort of line how this sort of comes out. We can have it sort of coming around here. And we're going to go with some trees that's in front of this one. Have them overlap here. And So yeah, just fill in this colour here. I can do a little bit of mist here if I want to. Let's just pull down here. I'm gonna see some reflections gonna come in the water here. Just gonna pull that down there. And we'll just put a nice little water line coming down here. things going on. Just give him some little let's see. Go to about sort of there, there. Just something like that, a little fade a little faded part of that. We're gonna have a big one there. Okay, I'm gonna go and come down to about there. There we go. We have one there. Water reflections. Come down a little bit further down here. Just tuck it into that sort of colour there. Just cut, just a bit of mountain sort of reflection colour really. That's all I'm looking for. Let's pull that down. Okay, let's go across here. Okay, right down here. Lots of paint. And all of a sudden the picture's changed. Crazy, eh? Changes everything. We can go into some yellow ochre, some red as well. This should be quite nice. Little bits of red. Just some little bushes. There we go. Evergreen falls. Hopefully that'll be worth some money in days to come. Who knows? And there's the painting. Quick, have a look at the painting. There is painting 299. Nice little painting, I think.